Good morning, viewers all over the world. This is uh, Trumpet Media World Impartation. You are welcome one more time this week. We give God the glory that we can meet again and we can share the word of God together. I am Pastor Abby by name. We thank God for the World Outreach Evangelical Ministry that is powering this Trumpet Media World Impartation. We give God the glory for this and we say, this day, we are going to look at some certain things from the Word of God this morning. We are looking at this morning, Word of His power, Word of His power, Word of His power. Word is power. Power is energy from the invisible realm affecting and shaping things in the visible and the tangible realm. Power is the capacity to transform an internal desire to an external manifestation, manifest activities. We look at the book of Luke 5, 17. We stated, now it happened on a certain day as he was teaching and the power of the Lord was present to heal them. Now, it happened on a certain day as he was teaching, the power of the Lord was present to heed them. Praise God. We are to daily pray that the God, God's will continuously make us the earthly container, the earthly container and discharge of his power power to heal power for word power and every manifestation of power of god in the book of john chapter 1 1 to 4 it says in the beginning was the word and the word was with god and the word was god verse 3 say all things were made through him and without him which is the word nothing was made nothing was made in verse 4 of his he said and the word became flesh and dwelt among us and we behold his glory from the scriptures we see that the light of god the life of god the power of god and the word of god known from eternity as the son of god taking up the form of man what a joyful, unexplainable. When we read the scriptures like this, our heart shout for joy. And we say, thank you, Jesus. Thank you, the internal word of God. Thank you for dwelling with us, God. God in us, revealing in us, truly, your name is called Emmanuel. To draw the power of God into your life, you will by faith accept this basic scripture proposition. One, we we'll look at every word of everything was created by the word of God. Two, everything was put in place by the word of God. Three, everything is manifested by the word of God. Hallelujah by the word of his power for everything respond to the word of his power five the fig tree respond to the word of his power we are looking at the word of his power this day six your liver your kidney your placenta your blood your heart your bone your muscles and your techno must respond to the word of his power your head and every says in your body respond to the word of his power your finance certainly respond to the, the word of his power praise god hallelujah hallelujah every storm every atom every miracle respond to the word of his power every solid liquid gas function integrated or disintegrated by the word of god the whole have yes and respond to the word of his power 
11, unseen angels, unseen beings, are mandated to carry out, perform, and execute the word of God. Demons, spirit, and every satanic respond in submission to the word of his power. Praise God. I pray this morning that we will have faith to raise up, uh, rise up and pray with boldness, with boldness, that the word of his power will prevail in, e our, in every aspect of our life. I pray this morning that we will raise up in faith, with boldness, that the word of his power will prevail over everything in our life this morning. In the name of Jesus. Everything respond to the word of his power. When Jesus speak, the fig tree respond to the word of his power. Praise God. As Jesus was praying, that same, as Jesus was preaching that same day, the power of God, the power of his word was there to heal. So everything in life respond. And I pray this morning that everything will respond to the word of his power. Praise God. I speak to someone today in every area of your life that you are facing storm. I speak peace unto it in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for someone today in the name of Jesus that every light of the wicked in your life I pray that they will be put out permanently in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that everything that is written against you, I pray that that thing will be totally reversed in the name of Jesus. I pray for you that is sick today because everything, sicknesses respond, cancer respond to the word of of his power. So I pray for you today by the tribe of Jesus that kidney be healed in the name of Jesus. I'm speaking to somebody now that that kidney in your life be healed in the name of Jesus. That placenta be healed in the mighty name of Jesus. That back pain be healed in the name of Jesus. That spinal cord be healed in the name of Jesus. You will prevail in every situation Whatever situation that looks so high, I pray that by his word of his power, you will prevail in the name of Jesus. The word of his power will prevail over every situation in your life in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray for you that all form of wickedness, you will overcome it in the mighty name of Jesus. You will overcome it. Whatever you are going through now, you will overcome it by the word of his power in the name of Jesus. I pray that everything that has been frustrating you for a very long time, I pray that that thing be frustrated by the word of his power in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray that that pain of hardship, that pain, of lack, that pain, that struggle you are going through, I pray by the word of his power, that thing is gone in the name of Jesus. I pray for you today that the peace of his power, of the word of his power, rest upon you today in the mighty name of Jesus. Thank you one more time. I'm looking forward to see you next week. The Lord bless you and be in peace and keep on believing in the word of God's impartation. Thank you. God bless you.